Hi everybody, Tom Forgione here from thomasforgione.com and Web Alliance International Agency. Uh, I just wanted to go over some things with you. Uh, I think it's pretty important that you know that strategic marketing is very important for your business. Now, strategic marketing is not just where you advertise, what you put on your website, um, blogging, social media. That's not just strategic marketing. Strategic marketing is asking questions like how are your products doing? Are your prices still competitive? What kind of uh, evaluation can you do on your marketing processes in your whole company? Also things like should we bring on a new product or service? Uh, we've uh, you evaluated let's say a competitor and now you notice that they're selling something that you should be selling and um, you need to you know create a strategy to see after you flesh out the strategy if it'll be profitable for for you to bring on that product now you also find things like who to market to where to market how much to charge how much should you be paying to market what's your cost per acquisition that's all strategic marketing strategic marketing should be done you should evaluate your strategic marketing at least four times a year to see how you're doing to see if you need to make adjustments course corrections in your business so you can make more profits unless you're doing really well and you don't care about uh, bringing in more profits or leaving money on the table then that's fine then you don't have to do any of that okay so a really important part of strategic marketing evaluation is evaluating your prices to make sure that your prices are in line with what the market can afford and also to make sure that you're competitive and to make sure that you're charging enough if you sell something and you're getting no price resistance at all it could be because you're not charging enough okay or you're just some fantastic salesperson now I hope that's the case and you're some fantastic salesperson but just in case you want to do a competitive evaluation and see what the market is uh, charging for the same exact products and services now not just charging also what are they getting they might be getting a bonus they might be getting something in addition to the product or service that helps uh, the competitor steal your business okay you want to evaluate that also too we've spoken about this before including a hundred percent money back unconditional money back guarantee um, you might want to try that too but okay so in addition to that as I said before you want to evaluate your competitors uh, make sure you're still competitive and make sure you're serving your your customers better than your competition if you're not guess what you gotta do you gotta figure out what they're doing better than you and you gotta do it better than them simple as that right um, maybe it sounds a little simpler than that but if you take really good notes and you really evaluate your competition not just going on their website and seeing what they're doing on their website um, this will help you you know now uh, if your customers are asking you for certain things and you're losing the sale because you're not selling those items but the customers assume that those items are part of your industry and you should be selling them this is a no-brainer you have to figure out a way to sell those items you have to see if they can become profitable for you and if they are you start selling them simple as that now a good way to do a competitive evaluation for products and services to check out your competitors and see if they're selling something that's different than what you're selling track it see what's happening see where they're advertising see where they're advertising in terrestrial print TV radio and also online through uh, you know pay-per-click on social media Facebook see if they're continuously advertising it normally if they're continuously advertising it they're probably making a profit on it okay uh, let's hope that they're not you know silly and they're just spending money just to spend money usually you don't spend money in advertising unless you're seeing a return on investment okay there are some that don't do it that way but that's the way you should be doing it now so if they're promoting it heavily and you see it going on for weeks and it's a new product before you bring it on if the product is low enough in price for you to be able to purchase it purchase it 
sign up for their email list, do anything you can to do an evaluation of how they sell the product all the way through. If they have a sales funnel, duplicate it. If they have an email autoresponder, duplicate it. If, they are, if they're advertising on Facebook, you advertise on Facebook. If you uh, see them advertising on Facebook and you want to find out how they're targeting, it's easily done. Let me know and I'll help you with that. So remember though, don't steal anything. Don't steal copy, don't steal images, don't steal anything. But you can, you can quote unquote steal a process if it's, it's a successful process. People have been doing it for since marketing started, since people have been selling things. You see someone doing something successful, you pattern your business after it, at least you have a good chance of also being successful instead of reinventing the wheel. Again, unless you have millions of dollars to spend to try to uh, be the first to do something, I suggest you pattern your marketing after successful marketing campaigns. It's pretty simple and it's very easy to find out what people are doing if it's a, especially if it's a digital based um, marketing campaign. Okay? So, um, that's it for this video. I, if you are interested in more videos, just hit the subscribe button and uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel. And next time there's a, a YouTube uh, video, you'll, you'll get a notification. Don't worry, it won't be spam, nothing like that. And uh, if you have any questions, please uh, use the comment section or email me or visit my website, use my contact form. I'll try to get back to everyone if possible. I do get a lot, so uh, bear with me. Okay? Thank you again for watching and have a profitable day.